Hi, I'm Sir Oliver, your online math tutor. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, panibagong video, panibagong topic na naman ang pag-aaralan natin ngayon. So, tapos ko nang i-discuss ang Introduction to Cartesian Coordinate Plane na invent ni Rene Descartes at pinag-aralan natin yung iba't ibang parts. Ngayon naman ay magpa-plot tayo ng points sa Cartesian Coordinate Plane na napakahalaga sa pag-graph ng mga equations. Take note of these graphing basics. Always start at 0, 0 every point or units at the origin so laging tandaan na dito tayo nag-start sa may pinakagitna yung sa intersection ng x and y axis in plotting the ordered pair x, y or the coordinates remember the directions of both the x and y axis Napakahalaga na alam natin yung direction ng X and Y. Marami dito yung nalilito or marami dito yung napapagpalit yung direction. Okay, kapag X-axis, it goes either left and right. Again, left and right direction. So, pinapakita dito sa illustration, kapag siya ay going to the left, our X is negative. Kapag naman going to the right, ang x natin ay positive. Again, kapag left ay negative, kapag right ay positive x. Kapag naman y-axis, ito yung ating vertical axis, pinapakita dito sa illustration yung arrow. Kapag siya ay going up, our y-axis is positive. Kapag naman going down, ang ating y-axis ay negative. Again, the direction of our y-axis is either upward or downward. Kapag upward, positive. Kapag downward, ay negative. So, ngayon, since alam na natin yung direction, so let's look at plotting. First example natin ay 2-1. Mag-start tayo sa 0-0, sa origin, and then we have positive x, which is 2, So, we need to move right 2 units. So, ipapakita dito. Ayan. Nag-move tayo ng 2 units to the right. Because our x is positive. Ang ating y naman ay 1. So, move upward 1 unit since it is positive. Okay. And then, you need to plot the points. So, that is 2, 1. Okay, let's have another example. So, plot for negative 2. Okay, start at 0, 0. Our x-axis is 4, which is positive. So, therefore, we need to move 4 units to the right, as shown. And then, our y-axis is negative. So, therefore, we need to move 2 units downward. Okay? And then, after that, plot the points that is... Plot the point that is four negative two. So as easy as that. Another example. So now let's look at plotting negative three five. So start at zero zero. So the same process. And then our x is negative. Therefore, we need to move three units to the left. And then your y axis is five, which is positive. Therefore, we need to move 5 units upward and then we need to plot the points that is negative 3, 5. Okay, how about this example? 0, 4. How are we going to plot 0, 4? So, start at 0, 0. So, we notice that our x is 0. So, therefore, there will be no movement either right or left since ang ating ang x value ay 0. And then, yung ating y value ay 4. So, move 4 units upward. So, kung mababansin, our point lies on the y axis. Where ang ating order pair ay 0, b. Yung b natin, it's either positive or negative. Again, kapag ang ating value ng x ay 0, it lies on the y axis. 
For our last example, so we are asked to plot negative 5, 0. So start at 0, 0 and then negative x. So therefore, we need to move 5 units to the left starting from the origin. And then no movement upward or downward since our y axis is 0. So therefore, our point lies on the x-axis. So, kabalik tara na naman siya kapag meron tayong value ng x. So, now let's have an activity. Okay. For your activity, you need to plot these points on the Cartesian plane. So, pwede nyo munang i-post yung video. Kumuha muna kayo ng graphing paper or kahit anong papel na available. Mag-drawing kayo ng Cartesian plane and then you need to plot the following points. So, items 1 to 6. And then later on, i-reveal natin yung answer and then check your own work. So, I hope na nagets nyo agad yung ating discussion para hindi na kayo mahirapan kapag ang topic na natin ay graphing linear equations. That's all for our video. Don't forget to subscribe at hit ang notification bell para updated ka every time na magpo-post ako ng bagong video. Thank you for watching.